In previous videos, we have discussed uh, the number systems, where there are four number systems in the calculators, the decimals, the hexadecimals, the binaries, and the octals. And as we learned how to convert uh, a number from one base to another base, okay? And we also discussed the numbers and the letters that we use for hexadecimal systems and also uh, the difference between the variable and the numbers in hexadecimal systems. In this video, uh, I'm going to discuss how to input a number with certain base, okay, by using these uh, calculators. Okay, let's say we have four numbers here with different base. The first one is uh, base 10, which is decimal. The second one is base 2, which is binary. The third one is base 8 which is octal, and the last one is base 16, which is hexadecimal. And I would like to convert all of these numbers into a uh, decimal. Uh, let me switch on the calculators first. Okay, so to perform calculations with different base, we need to go to the mode and then uh, choose uh, four, okay, four, and then straight away, these screens pop up. We can see that now uh, the base is decimal, eh? decimal, and uh, that's what we want because we would like the answer to be displaced in decimal. And then let's key in uh, the first numbers. Eh? The first numbers is uh, 55 with base 10, which is a decimal. Eh? Okay, now to tell the calculator uh, this is base 10, we use this button here, okay? We can see that there's a base here, right? Okay, so shift base. Eh? Now, after we click on this shift base, uh, we can see that there are a few options here. Now, this is for uh, logic operations. So this is not what we want. Okay, then we can see that there's a small triangle here. Okay, it shows that we have another screen. Eh? So let's tap on this uh, down arrow buttons here. Okay, so after we tap on this, then we can see that we have four options here. The first one is D. D stands for decimal. Eh? The second one is H, uh, that's hexadecimal. The third one is binary and the last one is octal. Okay, now in our case, we would like to tell our calculator that uh, uh, this number is a decimal, uh, base 10 decimal, so we choose one. Okay, so this is decimal and the values of this number is five five. Uh, okay, decimal number five five. Uh, okay, five five. When we click on equal, then we can see that in uh, decimal systems, this is written as 5.5, five, eh? okay, so decimal 5.5. Five. The second one is uh, 11011 in binary, so uh, we use this button, shift, base, down, okay, so let's tell the calculator that this is binary, eh? so binary is 3, okay, and then the number is 11011, eh? so 11011. Now this is in base 2 eh, binary eh, when we tap on equal the calculators will give the answer in decimals eh. in decimal this is 27 okay in binary this is 11011 eh, but in decimal this is 27 so 27 and the third one is 76 eh, with base 8 so shift base down Okay, so this is octal. Eh? Octal means uh, number four, eh? number four octal. Okay, and then the number is seven six, eh? seven six, so equal. Okay, so this is equal to 62, eh? 62. And so the last one, uh, this is uh, base 16, which is hexadecimal, eh? hexadecimal. So shift, uh, base, down. Okay, so hexadecimal is number two. Eh? Okay, so this is hexadecimal, and then number is ACF. Now remember, don't use alpha, because when you use alpha, then so what we uh, key in will be the variable, okay, but not the number. In this case, this tree, ACF are numbers. Huh? So straight away, tap on A, and then uh, C, and then F, huh? okay? So hexadecimal ACF, and equal. Okay, so this is equal to 2,767. So ACF in uh, base 16 equal to 2,767 in decimal. So that's how we input a number with different base. So we use this shift base and down to choose uh, the base for a number 
before we perform the calculations. Okay. Now let's see uh, this example. Okay. So we are going to discuss uh, the operations of a number with different bases. Uh, let's start with uh, additions of two numbers in base two. Okay. So uh, let's uh, switch on the calculators. Okay. So this is base two. Uh, base two is binary. So let's go to binary. And then so let's start to key in this number one zero one zero one one zero one zero one zero one one zero and then plus uh, okay plus one one zero one 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 okay plus one one zero one 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 okay equal so the answer is one zero 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 one one zero one okay and in base two eh? one zero 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 one one zero one in base two okay so that is the uh, operations uh for a number with binary base okay binary number operations of binary number uh which is a number with base two eh? okay uh the second example is uh, additions of two numbers with base eight eh, which is octal so let's go to octal uh so let's clear the screen first and then let's go to octals eh? okay uh two seven five 275 plus 316 okay uh, the answer is 613 in base 8 okay another example sir. uh this is in hexal decimals 19 19 plus 3f hexal decimals so uh, let's clear the screen and then let's go to hexal decimals 19 plus 3 uh, f Okay, one nine plus three f equals. So the answer is uh, fifty eight with base sixteen. Okay, the last one. Now the last one is a little bit complicated because all the four numbers are in different bases. Okay, the first one is base sixteen, the second one base ten, the third one base two, and the last one's base eight. So their bases are not the same. And let's say we would like our answer to be displaced in decimal. So let's choose uh decimals huh? okay decimal okay so now let's start to key in uh this number the first one is hexal decimals huh? so shift base down then we choose uh, hexal decimals huh? two and then this number is two b two b again don't use don't use alpha eh? okay because if you use alpha it become a variable but not number now this this is supposed to be a number, eh? okay, and then plus. Okay, this is in decimals, eh? and we set this to decimal, so we don't need to tell that this calculator this is decimals. Eh? Okay, straight away we can uh, uh, tap in one three, eh? okay, plus. So if we do not tell the calculators about the base, then the calculator will automatically assume that this is the base uh, as this one. Eh? Okay, so this is decimal, so this must also be decimal. Okay, after that, um, we have this uh, 1, 1 eh, for binary, okay, base 2. Eh? So we tell our calculator that this is uh, binary, binary, and then uh, 1, 1. And the last one is octals, eh? octals, shift, base, down, octals, eh? 4, and then the number is 5, 3, eh? 5, 3, and equal. Okay, so the answer is 102 in decimal. Okay, 102 in decimal. So that's how uh, we perform the operations, additions, uh, subtractions, multiplications, or divisions uh, with uh, numbers of uh, different bases. Okay.